I'm Lauren of All Trades, and today I'm in Cozumel, Mexico. Today we are in Cozumel, Mexico. We were here uh, nearly three years ago, and we did an excursion called Snuba, which is this cross between scuba diving and snorkeling, uh, which was actually a lot of fun. And we're gonna walk by where that is, so I think we can get a little bit of video and show how that kind of works. Um, after we went snoobing, we walked down a little bit farther from the ship to a restaurant to get lunch because uh, we wanted something local, and we just had the biggest bowl of guacamole. So we decided that's what we're gonna do today. Um, we're gonna be back here in just five days, and we have an excursion booked for. Um, for that day, so we just wanted to get off the ship, explore a little bit, and eat a ton of really good fresh guacamole. Uh, so here we are in the like duty-free area where they try to sell us a lot of a lot of stuff. We're gonna try to blow right by it and find some Wi-Fi so we can figure out where exactly we are going. Because no, I didn't um, correctly look at it ahead of time. Take a look at that. This is where you can use some Wi-Fi, the Wi-Fi hut. We found our way out of the duty-free area. It was not a small feat. There are a lot of places that looked like we could leave, but they wouldn't let us. We were able to find the name of the restaurant, which is the Turquoise Beach Bar, so we'll be able to identify it from the road. It is just right along this main road that the duty-free area dumps you out onto, and then we took a a left turn and it's about a 15 minute walk. We're gonna walk because we don't want to spend money and we do want to get exercise. We've been eating a lot. We are coming up on Sand Dollar Sports which is where we did Snuba uh, last time we were in Cozumel. So we came in here. Uh, I guess we checked in over there and then included, oh no, we had to pay for a locker rental. That was extra. I feel like that could have been included, but it wasn't. And then they took us through here into a little room to do a little brief us on how it works. And then there is a bar and restaurant for when you're done. All right, so we've got some people scubaing, some people snoobing. The little floaty boats there, um, kind of in the middle of the screen, that is going, those have an air tank that provides air to all the snuba divers. So basically they just have a scuba mask, but they have ongoing, they have continuous air. So they don't have to come up for air, but they don't have to use like a regulator like you do for scuba, which is what people over here are getting ready to do. And it is a guided tour, so there's a guide that points out fish and interesting things in the water. The snuba was nice because we didn't have to learn how to scuba, which means that for the amount of time that we had off the ship, we had more time in the water. So when we were here, we decided that the menu didn't look amazing. So we chose to look up somewhere nearby to walk to, and we're gonna head there now and actually eat there again. We think that we found it. I think you're right. All right, we didn't find it. We found the Turquoise Beach Club. This is not the restaurant we ate at. So we're just gonna keep walking until we recognize it. So that should work out great. We found it. It is the Blue Angel Dive Shop which is also the Blue Angel restaurant. Question mark, handicapped, accessible. So we were close with the turquoise idea, but we were wrong. So we just get, we're just gonna get guacamole and have more to eat on, when we're back on board? Probably, yeah. The ceviche was also very good, which was one of the reasons why we came here. Um, we just don't want to spend a lot of money today, so we came strictly for the guacamole. So I had the caprese salad last time. Should we get one of those and split it? Okay. We're 
also going at 750. We're gonna get the caprese salad and split that also. Guacamole 6.99. We're gonna get a ton of guacamole and chips. And the ceviche. There's a small one and a big one. <laughs> the small one is 11.50 and the big one's 13. I feel like maybe you got the big one because you're like it's only a dollar fifty more. It was enormous, so it's great. Uh, the big shrimp ceviche would be great for splitting, but we're just gonna stick with those two things for today. There's our pile of guacamole. And we are not going to be getting crazy salad because they do not have it. So that's fine and we'll just um, skip getting anything else and we'll eat some more when we get back on board. We enjoyed our lunch. Afterwards, I was able to walk down and put my feet in the water for a little bit. It's quite warm out today. Uh, it's still September and in Mexico. Pretty much it for us today, but we will be back shortly, so there will be more to come.